Let's start here. You just don't see baseball played the way the 1980s Cardinals played the game anymore. I mean, imagine a team today finishing at the bottom of the league in home runs, stealing at least 200 bases total along the way, and then winning the pennant. Crazy, right? Well, the Cardinals did that three times in the 80s, and it won't surprise you, it hasn't happened since. I think it's been proven by a couple of the teams that I played on, you can drive in runs without hitting the ball out of the ballpark if you have a team that has four or five guys who can run, and we did. The squeeze play, it's a beauty. Whitey loved athletes, and he wanted athletes at every position. You know, Bush Stadium was a very hard ballpark to hit home runs in. Artificial surface, so it was a fast surface to play on. A sparkling defensive play by Ozzie Smith. So he had to have a track team. I mean, it was a track team, and once in a while, a baseball game would, would break out. So, I mean, that's really what it came down to. And he's got himself an easy double. Given the speed that we had on our team, every ground ball was a potential uh, base hit, and everything to the gap was two bases, three bases, maybe even all the way around. And you just never knew what was going to happen. That was wildly exciting. 